Uh, good evening. Uh, my name is uh, Hancock Beachcock, and uh, this is the Hancock Beachcock Cooking Show. And uh, we'll be looking at a couple of very interesting and uh, quick to do dishes tonight. Uh, this will include the um, uh, frozen chicken breast, the super duper fries, um, which come in packaging but can be cooked or can be eaten cold. Um, it's really, really your choice. Um, it's a very quick dish to whip up. Um, I prepared earlier this pies that I um, that I made. Um, my oh, this is just some packaging I found. Put it in so it doesn't get dirty. Um, it's my uh, auntie, auntie, aunt, mother's aunt, auntie's. Uh, it's someone's recipe, um, not mine. But uh, I basically found it and and decided well I'll just give it a whirl you know it didn't sound too bad I haven't had any yet um, if, uh, if if uh, you know if, if it doesn't work or you don't like it then uh, oh also before I forget we'll have an extremely special guest today um, you've probably seen him in the streets you know fighting crime and uh, uh, jumping up and down buildings and uh, General being a fucking nuisance, but we all love him, you know. And uh, please welcome Captain Robe. Captain Robe is Captain here. Captain Robe, uh, very nice to see you. Nice Captain to meet you too, bitch cop. Thought I'd get some mileage out of that one. <laughs> Thank you for coming in to today's cooking show. And, pleasure, uh, pleasure. Always a and, pleasure. Uh, I know that you're quite handy in the kitchen. I have heard you're I have, quite handy uh, in the well, kitchen. I, I have hands and uh, and I do and go you to do the go to the kitchen a bit now and then. Yes, uh, mainly Excellent. To, uh, to get myself beer. Yes. Now, um, I believe you have a little recipe that uh, we can we can do, um, which will include frozen uh, uh, chicken. Mm -hmm. um, Super fries, mm -hmm. preferably mm -hmm. McCain, mm -hmm. McCain, 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 mm -hmm. McCain, and. Uh, uh, I pre-made, homemade, made uh, those pies. The sergeant, the sergeant, the sergeant part. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I did it all, all fresh, out of, the, fresh yeah. out of fresh the, out of the. But yeah, yeah shut up. Um, now, uh, uh, what else? What are what other ingredients do you need for this? Is there right, anything uh, else that you need apart from look, every kitchen? In Captain Robe's opinion, and. Uh, I can come and help you with this. Mm. Okay. Uh, so anyway, what we need here, mm. every every kitchen, every kitchen must every have must. Uh, a, a massive cupboard solely dedicated to uh, herbs, spices, sauces, condiments, condiments. Yeah, um, uh, bread rolls, old rubber bands, uh, and uh, chip condoms. Cups. And uh, generally. Headache, right tablets, here. condoms. You can't see that because yeah. uh, the camera can't move. But no. Anyway. There's a very, very interesting cupboard just up over there here, which I will be uh, delving into with yeah. my funky little fingers. Yeah, those excellent, excellent. So I can't wait to get, get going. Now, I'm very um, excited to have you here. Okay, now uh, do we have time to do the full, uh, the full... Let's do the no? full hunky-dory. Yeah? yeah? Dory. Sweet. Well, well it's uh, not dory because it's not fish, it's, uh, it's chicken, but you know. What I like to do first is to uh, grab a pot. Pot. Uh, actually, because we're in the kitchen, yeah. um, and uh, we do have very strict uh, health rules. and safety rules yeah. in this country, and mm. Uh, mm. as, as Captain Robe, I feel it is my duty to mm. uh, to to say to you know all the kids out there, if you're ever going to be in a kitchen working or uh, slaving away as big work mom. over a hot stove, yeah. generally it's a good idea. It's actually it's actually a law yep. to have a suitable hairnet. Now, uh, mm. people have told me that my hair is a little extravagant. Extravagant. Um, and, uh, could be said. It could be said. It has been said. It's, it's not my said. fault. It was no. An, it was an accident. Lightning strike, I believe, wasn't it? Well, lightning and a, uh, and a sheep shearing machine. Mis uh, misfortune. I really don't want to go into any details. No, let's not. People got hurt yeah. um, emotionally and financially. Yeah. Um, and, uh, mm. and well, basically, the upshot of the story is that I am now going to put on my uh, my official, hairnet. official, my official uh, kitchen hairnet. That's uh, HSC approved. Uh, not HSC approved. It's actually uh, ADBD uh, and DBD <laughs> uh, approved uh, and by, by the, the National Registrar Council oh. of the uh, approvalists. <laughs> Don't get me started on bureaucracy. Yeah, yeah. Let's not. That's just well. Okay. Now we have our pot. Very nice pot. Pot. 
Frozen chicken. Yep. Straight in the pot. Yep. Uh, best to take Normally, the rubber bands off these guys because yeah. uh, they, they can get a bit, uh, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bit tired. Yeah, um, yeah. And, uh, and for the finishing touch, just a couple of uh, your fresh, freshly, freshly homemade, homemade frozen, frozen sergeant's pies. Sergeant pies. Just whack them on top there. Yeah, make sure. And then, actually, I usually leave this in for that excellent tangy flavour. I, I find I, that look, it brings, uh, brings colour to if it. If you'd let me uh, complete my, uh, my little spiel here, um, that was actually. <laughs> going to be added again at the end. Uh, we sit it aside for that express purpose that uh, we really do want And then that. grade it up later. No, no, it won't be graded. No, it'll, no. Be, it'll be placed upon uh, the finished plate. As a garnish. Hole over the top of it. Mm. Um, uh, yes, and, and it should be eaten with a uh, snail fork. So... That's, that's a fantastic idea. It's I, an unusual one. It is, um, but it's quite Pitchcock, interesting. But we'll get there yeah. later. This is pure great, bro. <laughs> later in the show. Okay. Now, what we do now is we open up our uh, condiments, condiments cupboard. Um, <laughs> and uh, basically, what I want you to do what? is you, the viewer at home. Oh, the viewer at home. Not, yes, not, yes. Uh, not you. Please make note of this. If you haven't got a pencil and paper, get one now. Yeah, uh, and write this down. Don't listen to Bitchcock, he doesn't know what he's doing. Yeah, um, write this down, don't li- what? Sorry, uh, sorry, you were saying? Uh, what you were saying? I was saying, you uh, were saying. what I want the viewers to do at home, to do, with, yes. their, with their freshly made pot uh, well, of freshly what do made you call this? ingredients. Well, it's a, it's a- What is the name for it? Do you have a special name? <laughs> Banana cake. <laughs> yeah, so what is, what name do you- <laughs> Banana cake. Uh, now, yeah. What is what, the, what, the, what the, name the, do you have for this 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 dish? I already told you, and we pissed ourselves laughing. Remember? Let's not do that again. <laughs> now, what I want the viewers at home to do with their fresh banana cake before they put it in the oven <laughs> is basically place your pot directly underneath your condiments cupboard, and uh, just basically grab as many things in there as you can. And just pile them on down into the bowl there. And if you break a glass, hopefully, don't worry. There's hopefully at least the, uh, you know, know, the coriander breaks and the uh, and, and the and the uh, and the <coughs> lime uh, particles pepper, uh, break as well. <laughs> so that you've got you know a decent a good mix sort of thing going on. Yeah. It's all, the best thing about it is that it's all random, completely random. It's great. <laughs> you just never know how it's going to turn out. Now. Whack that in the oven for about 600 years <laughs> and take it out. Here's what I prepared earlier. Great. Anyway, thanks, uh, thanks, Mitch uh, Collins. My, my uh, pleasure. It's, uh, it's been Captain been Robbie to Villaruregate. Thank you for taking the time out from your from your you know everyday duties mm -hmm. of saving people mm -hmm. and um, you know the general uh, sitting around uh, doing fuck all basically. You, yeah, yeah. You, well, you're uh, so good at doing that. I've, like, I've saved myself from doing that, and uh, yeah, and yeah, I, yeah. And so I'm, on, I'm on the campaign trail. Yeah. So um, look. Uh, okay. Yeah. So it's been great. Uh, no Thank you. you. No, I'm just gonna uh, take the seat. You don't mind if I take. No, it. no, please. Yeah, Because yeah, yeah, I know that no. you guys got all the ingredients made up. For yeah, it's, so it's, it's all it's good. Yeah, please um, take it with you, and uh, yeah. see you next time. Maybe on another show. On another show. The finishing. The garnish. Let's not forget the garnish. Yeah, yeah. Um, all right. Um, and, yeah. Uh, Make sure you take, take a knife and I have fork. to take my snail fork as well. Yeah. Yeah. And um, eat it up. Yeah. Fantastic. Okay. Thanks very much, Brad. No, no, not a problem. I'll, Thank you. Any time I can be come back on the show. Absolutely. Uh, when, when, if you have, if you think of any new recipes, mm -hmm. give us a call. And um, always got quite a few. Come in. Yeah. Uh, my, my loyal. Um, you know, people that <clears throat> sort of know me and shit. Friends. Oil. Oil? No, not really. Not, that, they're that, not your friends. That, that oil no, thing. accomplices. Um, well, no, no, they're, they're just people that I don't they're, really know. No. Um, that you've seen but don't yeah, really know. I, I don't really uh, know. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't think I'll be back. <laughs> Bye.